In this video, what is the Harmony Day in Australia and why it has been celebrated? Why orange is the color of Harmony Day? Stay with us to the end to find answers and also some exciting and less known facts like, what percentage of Australian were born overseas? As the great Maya Angelou once said, in diversity there is beauty and there is strength. Just like a vibrant patchwork quilt, each unique piece contributes to the overall picture, so too does diversity add richness and depth to our society. In Australia, we've found a way to not just acknowledge this diversity, but to celebrate it. Enter Harmony Day. Now you might be thinking, great, another day off work, but hold on to your hats mates, it's not just about catching some extra Z's. Harmony Day is a vibrant celebration of Australia's multiculturalism, a day to embrace our differences, and to recognize the strength they bring to our great nation. It's about unity, respect, and a shared sense of belonging. Harmony Week is celebrated during the week that includes the 21st of March, which is the United Nations International Day for the Elimination of Racial Discrimination. Harmony Day, a day when Aussies of all backgrounds come together, not for a Barbie, but to celebrate our shared values and vibrant multiculturalism. Imagine a palette with only one color, it would be as dull as a kangaroo without a bounce. Now, Australia, on the other hand, is a vibrant palette of cultures, like a dazzling mosaic, where each piece adds its unique color to the overall picture. And boy, what a picture it is. Let's take a stroll through this Aussie mosaic. First stop, the indigenous cultures, the original custodians of this land. They've been here for over 60,000 years, shaping the landscape with their stories, art, and spiritual connection to the land. Their influence is woven into the very fabric of Australia, adding a rich, deep hue to our palette. Did you know that more than 70 indigenous languages are spoken in Australia? Next, we have the British influence, from our convict beginnings to the waves of free settlers. They brought with them their customs, language, and a penchant for tea and cricket. Their influence is as clear as the Sydney Harbour Bridge on a sunny day. But the Aussie mosaic doesn't stop there. We've got the vibrant colors of Italy, Greece, Lebanon, China, India, Vietnam, and so many more. Each culture has left its mark, whether it's the delicious aroma of a Vietnamese pho, the lively Greek dances at a community festival, or the mesmerizing Chinese dragon parades during Lunar New Year. And let's not forget the Aussie knack for adopting and adapting. Take food, for example. We Aussies love to put our own spin on things. An Italian pizza? Let's throw some pineapple on it and call it Aussie style. A Lebanese kebab? We'll wrap it in a Greek pita, add some Vietnamese pickled veggies, and voila, the Aussie kebab roll is born. You see, each culture is like a brush stroke on the Aussie canvas, creating a picture that's as diverse as it is beautiful. It's this diversity that makes Australia what it is. A multicultural paradise, where everyone can find a bit of home, and perhaps discover something new. So next time you're munching on a pizza with pineapple, remember, that's diversity at work. Harmony Day. It's not just a day in the Aussie calendar, it's a lifestyle, mate. This day is a celebration of cultural diversity, a day where we come together as a nation to acknowledge and appreciate the different cultures that make up our vibrant society. Why? because nearly 49% of Australians were born overseas or have at least one parent who was born overseas. Also, since 1945, more than 7.5 million people have migrated to Australia. All people who migrate to Australia bring with them some of their own cultural and religious traditions, as well as taking on many new traditions. Now imagine a traditional dress parade where Aussies proudly sport their cultural attire. It's a sight to behold, I tell you. You might see your neighbor rocking a Scottish kilt, or perhaps your friend from the gym flaunting a flamboyant Hawaiian shirt. And who knows? It could be your golden opportunity to strut your stuff in a pair of German lederhosen or a Japanese kimono. A bit of friendly competition never hurt anyone. But the fun doesn't stop there. Art exhibitions, dance performances, music concerts, you name it, we've got it. Harmony Day is a potpourri of cultural expressions, a day where we learn, appreciate, and most importantly, have a good laugh together. Now you might ask why orange is the color of Harmony Day. The choice of orange as the color of Harmony Day in Australia holds deep symbolism and significance. Orange represents a fusion of colors, 
just as Harmony Day symbolizes the blending of diverse cultures, backgrounds, and perspectives into a unified whole. It reflects the idea of coming together, regardless of differences, to create something beautiful and harmonious. Additionally, orange is a vibrant and energetic color that exudes warmth, positivity, and inclusivity. It encourages connection, communication, and understanding among people from all walks of life. Furthermore, orange is also associated with the Australian landscape, particularly during sunset, where the sky often takes on shades of orange, evoking feelings of tranquility and serenity. Remember, Harmony Day isn't just about celebrating our differences, it's about creating a sense of belonging for everyone. It's a day that serves as a reminder of our shared values and aspirations, and the vibrant tapestry of cultures that we are privileged to be a part of. So, are you ready to rock those lederhosen next Harmony Day? Or maybe it's a sari or a dashiki that you've got tucked away in your wardrobe? Whatever it is, pull it out, dust it off, and get ready to join the celebration. And while you're at it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and share your Harmony Day plans. We're all ears, mate.